Hi, I'm Chuck Devanji, and I am teaching uh, this Math 142 class that you are taking at, uh, online through Whatcom Community College this summer. And I just wanted to show you um, some things about WAMAP. Using WAMAP, I wanted to uh, help you think about expectations for the course and um, how to navigate, what, what to expect week to week. So let's go ahead and start off with uh, taking a peek at the, at the syllabus. And so right now you can see the only things that are showing are announcements. This will always show uh, day one, getting started. So uh, we'll start there. Resources week one and week two. These weeks will fill in as, as time goes as time goes on, as we get closer and closer to, um, to those actual weeks. And what I'll try to do is I'll, I'll make sure that those are out by the Wednesday uh, before the actual week, for sure. Um, and you can tell that I, I don't have them all the way done at this point, but this is what it'll eventually look like. So let's go ahead back to student view. So if you uh, take a peek at announcements, I'll put stuff in here. Uh, this is a good thing to always check. Um, and here's our welcome announcement. Again, like I said, you got here, so here's great. Here's stuff I'd like you to do for day one is listed here. And then um, after you do that, um, you should start on the week one section. And I'll, I'll show you calendar a moment that um, that you should you should definitely kind of print out and, and use. So here's some things that will be due. Uh, these are when they're due by. This is the latest to do them. So you can always do them earlier. Uh, and the day one stuff would be great if you got it done on day one. So getting started day one. So there's a couple things. Here's a list of things that I'd like you to do for day one. Um, here's this video. So you're watching this video already. You've probably already read this. Um, read the syllabus and calendar. And uh, so if we go back to resources, we have syllabus and calendar. So let's take a peek at both of those real quick. I'm, I'm not going to read the syllabus to you, but I do want to highlight just a, just a couple of things. Um, that's my email for, uh, for Wacom. I will check it. Contact You can contact me straight through WAMAP uh, too. Let me scroll down to a couple of things. Uh, two things I'd really like to point out. We do have two tests that are face-to-face -face that we need to do. So the midterm and the final, and these are the dates for them, and this is where they happen. So um, if you are not in Bellingham, if you're taking this uh, some other way, please contact me so that we can, we can arrange for this to be proctored for you. Um, and as you are in Bellingham, if if these are impossible for you to make, do email me as soon as you can so we can make arrangements early. But other than that, do do show up for these two um, tests, please. Um, <laughs> grades, you know, that's just percentages. So the midterms were 30%. Uh, the finals were 35. So those are those two things that we just look at the dates for. Um, and then there's a couple of the people pieces. Practice quizzes and forums together are 15% as a category. And then time quizzes are 20%. So let's squeeze on down here to look at these. So the practice quizzes and forum. So the practice quizzes, these are, they're not time quizzes. Um, they're stuff that are directly related to what you were doing for that week. Um, you get four attempts on each question on them and you can do them, um, do them at your leisure during the week. Uh, you know, do some of the practice problems, make sure you feel good on it, and then go and try some of the practice quizzes. Um, they should be completed by 11.59 on their due date. And I'm, I'm making practice quizzes due on Fridays, I'm pretty sure, on Fridays. Um, and we'll see that on the calendar in a minute. And um, then, uh, and then forums, I'm going to have you um, respond to some prompts for forums. And you'll, you'll have to make some posting. I, the minimum posting you, you need to do in the forums is one, initiate post, which is a response to my prompt. And then second, you will need to respond to one of your classmates um, posts as well. Those have due dates as well, um, and they do go into the grade book. So do make sure that you're keeping up on the forums. Um, time quizzes are 20% of the grade. For the times quizzes, you, you start the time quiz and you get two hours from when you start it to complete it. Um, so as soon as you start and make sure that you're ready to do them, you get three attempts per problem. This is really, really uh, what teachers call formative. It's something that should like help you think about where you're at. It's a little higher stakes than the practice test. 
Uh, if you were doing the practice tests and doing well on them, the time test should be pretty straightforward to you. And the two hours is should be plenty of time for you as well to get through the time the time quiz. Um, the time quiz doesn't have a warning at the end that you're almost out of time. It will just you know just kind of shut down. So make sure that you uh, you have a good amount of time and you're ready for them. Those are also due by 11:59 on on the due date. So make sure that you you plan when you're going to take that appropriately. Um, Sometimes uh, these are self; these are graded by the by WAMAP, and I tried to set them up so it's a pretty good grading. If you feel like you're shortchanged from from a question, you feel like you got it right, and you're not under, you're not sure what happened, just feel free to let me know, and I'll take a look at it. It's no big deal. Um, one other thing I do want to point out: scrolling way down, campus resources. If you do not know about our math center at Wacom, check it out. It's an excellent resource. You can go in there; they will help you out. Um, with tutoring, that's great. Also, if you have questions, I do want you to get a hold of me. Um, we have messages in WAMAP. I'll talk about that in a minute. So that's the syllabus. Let's take a look at the calendar. This is something to print out and just and just have. Um, so I laid this out so that um, this is what the, your pacing should be to be on pace for here. So day one, here's day one right here. You should be um, doing the day one stuff. Um, 6.1 on this day, 6.2 on this day. I do want to point out that the way that I format it, things that are italicized are things that are due, and those are the dates that they're due at. And my due date's always uh, by 11.59 p.m. Um, so if you'll notice, they, the day one stuff is due by, by Wednesday, which is really day three. If you get a day done day one, that would be great. Um, you have a forum that's due on Friday for the week one forum and a, a practice quiz that's due by Friday. You can do it before. And then by Monday, the timed quiz for week one is due. And that's just going to be standard for the course. So forums and practice quizzes are due by Fridays. Time quizzes are due um, on, on Monday for, from the week before. And then your response for forums I give you um, until Wednesday to get responses to your peers. So you have some time to respond because, you know, everyone's posting at the last minute. Um, the midterms on here tells you where it is and when it is. So is the final. And you'll notice I uh, have a couple review days banked in around the midterm and the final for us as well. Really, if you if you print this and 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 just, you know, look at it, you are you're not going to miss. You're not going to miss. You get everything done on time and in. All right, so there's that. Um, do peruse this as well, typing math symbols in, in WAMAP. This is uh, this one right here. This is how you can write stuff so it's formatted uh, in WAMAP. You know, if you want if you want to make something that looks like this, this is how you would type it. This is a nice, nice thing to be able to do. And you can do that in, in messages. You can do that in the forums, the whole thing. All right, so there's that resources section. So I'm going to go back to day one because um, notice here, these are things that I want you to do. You're watching this video now. Quizzes and forums, each, each section, each block will have a quizzes and forums section. So if you'll notice, if you bring this down, here's the forum that I want you to, to do for first day, and here's the quiz that I want you to take for first day. Take those by that Wednesday of that first week. Um, they'll tell you when they're due. Um, it tells you when the new threads can start, when replies have to happen by, oh, it looks like I made threads due by Wednesday, replies by Monday. Oh, yeah, because that's the introductory one. Um, so make sure that you are on top of these as well. So there's that day one. And just that structure is the structure that I'll use for each block. So here's week one. And um, I talk a little bit about what the week is like. So then I have these blocks. So there's the 61625152. If you look at the, the schedule, 61625152, that's all the things that we cover in week one. So they're laid out right here. And if you open this up, I'll have a video lecture for each section. I'll have problems from the book that I think are really good problems to, to give a try to. Um, and then there's additional video links. Notice this says as needed. If you feel like you wanted to look at some other some other things, take a peek at that. 
Now I'll have that for each for each section. So section 6-2, let's see, that would be on Wednesday the 26th. Look at the lecture, do the problems, just like we had we had class every day. Um, so then there's the lectures and, and the problems. And then quizzes and forums. Um, I don't have it, I don't have them established right here, but you would open that up and it would show you uh, what quizzes and forums I want you to do. Now they um, they're not going to be available necessarily when the um, when the module is available. So, for example, um, forums and practice quizzes. I'll have them available at the start of the week. the The time quiz I won't have it available until Wednesday um, for you. So you can as soon as it's available, you can do it. But do uh, when you first look at a time. Um, sorry. When you first look at a, a quizzes and forum section, if nothing's in it, there there will be something in it later. Go with the calendar to tell you when it's going to be due. Again, times quizzes will be posted by Wednesday. Forms and and practice quizzes by the by the beginning of the week. Great. And like I said, these weeks will will fill in while the uh, while the quarter goes on. Okay, I'm almost done. So good job sticking with me here. So. Messages is here. These are these are um, this is basically our email that we can send back and forth for WAMAP. If you message me here, it, it's a great way to go about doing it. Um, I'll check this a lot. Forums. That's a place we can get straight to the forum, um, or you can get to it from the forum post as well. But you can always get to forums through here. The student lounge forum and the questions for instructor instructor will always be up too. That calendar, I don't use it. Use the printed one that I have. Um, it's I'm not going to have things connected to that calendar. All right. So, boy, that was feels long winded. I hope that uh, <laughs> I hope that you feel pretty comfortable being able to navigate this. If you're not, if you have any questions, email me. And this is true, like through the course at all. When when you run up against something you're not sure what to do, message me through WAMAP. Um, post something in the forum. And I, I will be con I will be checking it a lot. So I will get back to you quick. Uh, if you're stuck on a problem, I'll make a video, post it for you. If if you post that type of question in the forum, other people can benefit from it too. So if you're like, I just don't get number 17 on on section whatever, um, post that in the forum. I'll throw together a quick video, and everyone can can look at it and contribute to it. All right, I'm really looking forward to uh, to working with you all this summer, and. Uh, all right, good luck. Get to work.